up to day two. Um, she's got to try and be a little bit quiet because Tamsin's still in bed asleep. She fell asleep fully dressed with clothes last night. She's absolutely exhausted just from packing and everything. But we finally left. But as you'll see from the first little video, there's absolutely no footage of us getting in the truck and leaving. Um, she was just too distraught and upset about leaving the cat. And I think a bit embarrassed because it's taken us so long to leave. So not really playing Let's Make a Movie. It's made it a bit difficult, so I've got no footage at all of that. So here's some photos for you quickly. I am a little bit worried about the truck. It drives like you're steering a boat. Uh, you turn the wheel and it responds about half an hour later. So it was really no fun driving in the dark. Tamsin doesn't want to drive at night, but we were so late leaving, so I drove in the dark and now we're so tired that we've got up late. It's 10 o'clock in the morning. She's, you know, we're still not ready to go. So we need to try and change that so that we use all the daylight hours, get up much earlier as the days go on and, and use the daylight so we don't have to drive at night. Anyway, we got to Arizona. We went over the state line. Um, yay! We got to a place called Kingman. Um, we're staying in the Arizona Inn, which is very sweet, very nice, very clean and comfortable. Run by a really sweet little Indian lady. And there was a fantastic smell of curry when we got here, which actually made me quite nostalgic for Britain. Um, <laughs> bizarrely. And welcome to day two. Uh, this is a truck. It does actually look like we've done a bank job. This is my appalling camera work and sound. Surely it can't get any worse than this. <laughs> Yeah, it looks like we've got a few bits of gold bullion in there or something. I just do want to tell everyone, especially after that last week saw, if me holding my mobile phone doing this with a selfie stick, or a selfish stick as I call it, none of which I've ever used before, I've never even used a camera on my phone before, so it's the cheapest, simplest, most basic way you could possibly film yourself. Um, the idea being that I get better at it as we go along, and if I can do it, anybody can do it. I'm just I'm making an excuse basically, okay? It's going to look like crap. It's going to have very wobbly camera. As you saw, I don't know what's going on then. I've got caffeine hands, you know, I don't know. And um, and the sound, oh, the truck's really super noisy. So we're not going to be able to do any recording in the truck while we're going along. So that's just out. And um, yeah, it's all going terribly well. <laughs> yeah, bear with me. My God. Desert and snow cat mountains. It really is. And sort of deep green forest over there. That, that one. Probably. And the Simpsons cloud still. This is, is so noisy. Do you think anybody would be able to hear this? It's like a little large. Yes, we've got Switzerland to the left. <laughs> um, sort of cowboys and Indians to the right. Simpsons straight ahead. to Williams now, which is this historic town, and we made straight for Safeways to get food and Dairy Queen, so Tamsin could revisit her childhood, so she hadn't had one of these red things since she was six, and she stuffed it up her nose, and I was so intrigued because there was retro memorabilia everywhere, even in the toilets of the Safeway, so I thought I'd try and film it with my selfish stick, badly as you can see. <laughs> That's my own shit face. There's a woman in the toilet. <laughs> okay. This is Route 66 itself with the Arizona Motor Hotel. Looks fantastic. Look at that. Dolly shot. Where's the cocktails? Left or right? Right. Saddlebag, sandwich shop. The great old you can imagine this though, it's sort of a hundred years before, where the, you know this was just the saloon. Really. Uh, yeah. Oh look, there's the brewery, Canyon Brewery. I did put that on the map, strangely. That's the Route 66 Cafe. Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> we missed it. We missed it all. We've stayed by the Dairy Queen and the Safeway. That's hilarious. That's, we've missed all the all, all the retro. Well we've seen it now. <laughs> Grand, Canyon, Grand Canyon Hotel Towns. Oh, very cool. Oh look at all the sign, it's just a sign which is fantastic. Yeah. Bet there's some vintage shops here. Shops. 
sad that we don't have another square inch for any vintage I might find. Native America. Huh? Wanna have a look? Nah, I'm sure we've got loads of those yeah. coming up. Well, and we don't have any space for them. Whoops. I think I was... Oh, it's just telling me to continue on Route 66 for two miles and then turn on to the building. So coming out of Williams now, um, only we could do that. Miss most of the entire town, the whole point of it. <laughs> Um, and we thought we'd better put oil and water in the truck and uh, it took about half an hour to work out how to get the bonnet open, sorry the hood. Bye Williams! Um, this according to my Google is the Kebab, Kebab, <laughs> Kebab, Kaibob National Forest. Beautiful. <laughs> and um, it's very green. Oh, hang on, did you see that? Knife City. Knife City, is that a place? Okay, that's another one. Oh, we've got to go there. I can't believe it. Only in America could you have somewhere called Knife City. Wow, it was a hell of a build-up. But can we just go off, go off? Tamsin, come on. Is that... is that it? <laughs> okay, it's not a city, it's a shed, shack, and it's a shop. Brilliant. Love it. <laughs> Um, point of information, I'm doing the tourist thing. We are now coming up to the world's largest petrified tree. Biggest petrified tree in the world. Okay, got that? Ah! No, actually, that's scary. Okay, this isn't quite what we had in mind. It's not enormous, but it is petrified. I mean, it's been shit scared for 10,000 years. There we go. It's like quartz. some sort of tourist teepees I think are made out of concrete and um, yes there we go Geronimo's! Geronimo's! <laughs> bye Geronimo's I'm still not actually that scared are you? join us for the rest of day two at the meteor crater Tomorrow! Yeah! Petrified. I'm terrified. No, I'm terrified. Sheds. Sheds get us. Oh, me too.